Hello. I bet y'all did not think you'd see me this soon. Well, actually, I was already gonna film a video this week. And then Miss, Miss Taylor Swift had plans for us. She had plans. I'm going to be reacting to Evermore, the new Taylor Swift album. I can't believe I'm saying that. Like, I don't know about this for so long. I can't believe y'all are just now finding out about this. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> But I cannot believe she done released another album already. I feel like I'm in like a parallel universe. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if everybody else feels like that. Currently, 2.12 a.m. The day after she released this. She released this on like Thursday night going into Friday. It's Friday going into Saturday. I waited a whole day to listen to this on camera for the first time because I've been busy. So y'all should feel honored. You should feel honored. But we're going to do a reaction video. I have a, a troubled past with Miss Swift and doing reaction videos to her albums. I did one to Reputation like a while ago, a while ago, like whenever it came out. I mean, like four years ago now, almost three. Three years ago? Huh, yeah, hmm. That's crazy, it's only been three years and we've already gotten, wait, we've gotten like four albums in three years. Wait, 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 wait. Y'all wait. <laughs> oh my God, no way. Much to think about. No way we've gotten four albums in three years. <gasps> Cause that was TS5, right? Yeah, we're just, oh, oh my gosh, y'all. She's been feeding us. She's been feeding us. Anyways, so I did a reaction to Reputation and right before I went to bed, this was back when like, I first started my channel. I went to bed and I had gotten like 33 views in an hour, which is like a lot for me. Even now, if I got 33 views in an hour, I'd be like, oh my God. I was like, wow, I wake up the next morning and I'm like getting ready. I was going to class and I check and I'm like, why do I have like 40 views? Like that just doesn't add up that like this is how this would go, you know? So I look and my video got flagged. No, not copyright. Somebody reported it to like YouTube for like a community violation. And I don't like, I don't know what it was. I don't know if I just like saying something about a song that people really like that I was like, no, oh wait, unnerving. If that closes, I'm gonna have to keep an eye out for that. <laughs> um, so somebody, anyways, somebody reported my video and it got taken down and I had to like, and this was like in like the prime of it like getting views, right? I was like on it. I had it up within hours of the album being up. Someone took it down and it took like a couple days for them to like put it back up and I was like, girl, at this point ain't nobody looking for Taylor Swift reaction videos, which I mean, at this point I'm like, oh, who's gonna be watching this video? We'll see, we'll see. It's topical. But yeah, we're gonna react. I haven't listened to anything. Y'all, I have barely even looked at any like discourse or anything. And I guess I'm gonna have to play the music on screen too, which that's gonna be a lot of work for me. So Willow, I know is the first song in the album. You can watch the music video to that. Let's get started. I'm like so excited. Oh wait, I want to talk about my thoughts beforehand. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a little bit scared. I don't know. Like, is it gonna hold up to folklore? I don't know, y'all. What, what am I expecting? I'm expecting some bops. I mean, y'all, literally Taylor Swift could release like just playing the banjo and singing the letters of the alphabet over and over and I would be streaming it. Oh my god, y'all lost my hair. I'm so sorry, everybody. Let's get into this one. I'm pressing play. Not the crude's ad. Go. Okay. I saw this part online of her singing at the thing. Oh, the... Oh, the the end of... Or that little... That's, um... Oh, it's the end of Lakes. Just rewind it. That's what it is. I think it's the Lakes, though, which makes sense because it was the last album on the last one. Invisible string. One single thread of gold tied me to you. Oh, wait. Why am I gonna cry? It's a willow. Oh my god. The gold theme throughout the last few albums. It's really nice. Oh my god. She said social distancing. I love that lyric. Oh my gosh. Oh, but she gotta go through the. Ooh. She Nicole. They said, yeah, we're wearing masks. How did she get all these people and none of them said nothing about. Oh, okay. A lot of thoughts and theories is, I'm wondering, okay, so we all know like that gold string, right? Invisible string. One single thread of gold that died me to you. We all know her. We know that that's probably what that is, right? So then if we're thinking about like is invisible string and Willow tied together because of the music video, but then also Willow and music video and cardigan music video. You know what I'm saying? That's interesting. Oh my God, wait, y'all, I'm like going off about it. I was gonna, okay, y'all, I was gonna do a video about the real meaning behind like Betty and cardigan in August. And that's actually the video I was gonna put up this week. And I didn't know Taylor Swift was gonna release an album. So I think I just came up with a theory. Okay, y'all, I'm coming back to this one. Anyways, we're gonna listen to Champagne Problems now. 
Bam. I don't know if I want to put the lyrics or not, because I'm, I'm a girl who enjoys it, like, I like to learn the lyrics over the course of, like, a year. This album's a lot shorter than the last one. She said introduction. Okay, main character type of stuff. Me. My, not me, like not reacting to things. But I know. I think that thing she said about like two people having plans, like me. One person's like ready to propose, and one person's like we're writing it. That's this one. I think you. I feel like reading ahead on the lyrics. I'm like, oh man, spoilers, y'all. Not me. Also, not me. Re not reacting. I'm so sorry, y'all. Might just touch out with this gold theme. Gold themes. Yep. 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 Lana Del Rey, right? One for the money, two for the show. Is that a Lana Del Rey quote, or is that just like a thing? She said, this is like a Taylor Swift bridge, period. <sighs> she swore. I think this one's about lesbians. I don't know why I got that vibe. Oh, she'll patch up your tapestry that I shred. I don't know why I was like, oh, lesbians. I don't know. Hold on, y'all, wait. Oh, my God, gold rush. Hold on, y'all, I closed the door. I missed the beginning of gold rush, okay. Twinklin'. Twinks? Taylor, are you a friend of Tyler Oakley? What's a gold rush? <gasps> okay, I'm sorry. I'm just thinking about this right away, though. No, y'all, I'm live reacting to this, so y'all, I'm gonna be watching this while I just be like, oh, this doesn't make no sense. But gold rush, gold rush. I don't like that anyone would die to feel your touch. In last song, she literally said, your mind is touched on the Chevy door. The way I know that lyric, I'm a Swifty at heart. I'm just saying connections, 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 you know. Funny, everyone. Sorry, y'all, I wasn't paying attention. I'm like sad, I'm lonely. Oh. oh my god, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. She said we're turning it for a twist. What? Okay, wait, we're going back to that twist. With your hair fun to play into the lace, I get done. Me singing the wrong words. I feel like that Wendy Williams video. So I'm imagining that this song, Gold Rush, I don't imagine that they're together or they get together. But so I was thinking the Coastal Town, the Last Great American Dynasty, which that's song number three, two, and tis the damn season. Okay, we'll see what this one is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. She said, wanted to know who you were hanging with. Taylor, is this a Christmas song? Hold on. She sounds like at my parents' house. Little Hallmark moment, kind of in a moment, in a way. Bad. Okay, she released this one for the people going home for Christmas. So I'm saying, y'all, don't do nothing that Taylor wouldn't do. This chorus. Maybe Thanksgiving, she or it's about either or. Y'all know about Ride Around. Y'all, I'm so alone. I don't know, I'm. Why does my forehead look so big like that? The heart I know I'm breaking is my own, period. I wonder if this is like her. I feel like this is like her writing about a relationship in high school. Tis the damn season. You could call me babe for the weekend. I'm staying at my parents' house. Y'all know about riding around. If you don't know, I'm sorry. You're not a main character. And the, I'm just gonna start off by saying, like, if you get it, you get it. If you don't, you don't. If you know, you know. And if you don't know, like, I honestly feel bad for you. Like, I, I cannot explain it. Like, I don't have the vocabulary to sit here and explain. Like, 
Either you get the vibe or you don't get the vibe. That was really interesting, you guys. I'm gonna start drinking some water though. I don't know if I'm gonna start crying. Tolerate it. Okay, this is track five. We all know track number five. We know what girl she is. And I'll say it. Bangers. Absolute bangers, as we all know. Dear John, all twelve. That's all I gotta say about that part. Or it's in the tolerate now. Oh my god. Okay, who's this about because they're reading? Hold on. about she said i'm gonna swear in one album and then it, nothing's off the table anymore i say as she just said one word but oh my god that line i know my love should be celebrated but you tolerate it is this about jake chillin huh i just threw that name out i don't know This one's gonna hurt in a couple of days, I feel like. It's gonna hit. This is a song that I'm gonna get just to hit with. No. Not me. It, this is gonna hit in a couple of days, two seconds later. So I think that in that they end up together, whoever it is about. That's what I'm saying. I'm just going with like my thoughts about like whatever these stories are, because in case it comes up, they're together at the end of that. Because she says, I'm still watching you. She's still watching. Okay. Nobody now crime. I know people, shout out to Maddie Benke. This is her favorite song I've heard. Oh, ambition. I don't know how to say country. Ooh. I was talking in golf a little bit harder. This is my cowbell or something. Yeah, she sent it back with the country. Yeehaw, girls. Not Olive Garden. Not Essay's Bad. Essay Lauder? Oh, he killed her. These people are crazy. No, no, no. She's killing somebody. She's coming for those country radio stations. Oh, I accidentally skipped the song. Okay, happiness. Is a butterfly. Honey, when I'm above the trees. Oh, when I'm about the trees. <gasps> Is this this is track seven? <gasps> if y'all don't get that connection, I'm sorry, but all the years I've given it to would you fight enough? Not the swearing. I haven't met the I think she broke up with Joe, but I know that ain't true because he wrote that other song. I've never been in a relationship. Tell me when did your wings smile? Begin to look like a smirk. Y'all, okay, that line. Tell me when did your winning smile begin to look like a smirk? She knows something. I hope she'll be a beautiful face. Okay, great Gatsby. Seven years in heaven. Taylor! I'm above the trees. Green light. Oh my god. Hello, 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 hello. Green light of forgiveness. Earlier she says, I hope you'll be a damn fool. 
came as Great Gatsby. One came as Lord Stans. Also, this one, it feels so connected to champagne problems to me. Anybody else? I don't know. I just get that vibe. The like happiness after me. Divine. Kind of hit that note. Some about that dress at midnight. There's a connection there somewhere. Who did she date for seven years? Some with the Great Gatsby. Did she date Leonardo DiCaprio? No, I know she didn't. There's a connection between Great Gatsby here, though. Okay, Dorothy. Dorothy. Hey, Dorothy. Hey, Dorothy. Do you ever stop and think about? Oh, gay. Gay. Phone. She said gay rights. Y'all, I've been reading ahead. I'm so sorry, y'all. I need to put something about this. I can't keep reading ahead. Tupelo. Oh my god, I love this. Hi, hey, I'm recording this right now while editing, just to point this out. I listened to the song quite a bit, quite a bit in the time since I originally filmed this, and I'm just now, while editing, hearing the way that Taylor Swift sings the word scheme here. Just to piss off your mom and a pageant schemes. There's something up with that, so make up your own mind about that. Let's go, lesbians! Let's go, lesbians! Excuse me, lesbians coming through! Woo! She's gonna be like, they're best friends, no. It's gonna be like James said at the end, hear that. If I hear that, always know me. I don't know the melody to this, so don't pretend. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. from a swift on that one she knows how to keep her audience interested for a dollar who's better emma stone or taylor swift taylor swift what do you think lesbian taylor swift what do you think taylor swift she knows what she's doing and girl i'm living okay coney island featuring the nation the nation not the nation the national very interesting to see what this is very long ago right maybe queen of coney island i can't believe this album exists <laughs> Oh, she said, yeah, I'm leaving town. Ancestry.com. Long haul. That's a phrase I feel like I know I've heard before. And I'm sitting on a bench in Coney Island. Oh, Coney Island. Back time to fly back to Mexico. Where'd you go? Over and over. Oh. Her voice on these last two albums is just like, girl, who's she going to Coney Island with? Googling it. Ooh. No, John Mayer. I need to look this up. Hold on, is this just about like all kinds of men? Wait, this has to be. Okay, did you? I paint your bluest sky the darkest gray. Hello, you paint me a blue sky, then go back and turn it to gray. <gasps> Big cake, happy birthday. Oh my god, this is, this has to be just like at all kinds of guys. Big cake, happy birthday. That's Jake Gyllenhaal. Shay Jake, I love Spider-Man Far From Home, but did I paint your blue sky as dark as gray? John Mayer, The Accident, Harry Styles. So whose name did she forget to say? Calvin Harris is what I'm getting then. I feel like Calvin Harris would be the one that'd be upset about that. No shade. You my centerfold. What's that about? Now I need to go back to this beginning of the song. Centerfold. Who was she at Coney Island with? That's question number one we have, right? Ivy. Oh, 
Oh my god, this one. Fatal flaw that makes you long to be magnificently, magnificently cursed. What's up with that? You want what's for me. This song is so sad, but like. It's been promised to another We're in the house. That... Hello. I'd live and die for moments that we saw. Our secret moments. Oh, wait. <laughs> not me like, oh, not me thinking. What? Who said that? Oh, I. This is so. I feel. That girls know what I'm talking about. Ivy. There's something there. That name. Ooh. Oh, she swears in this one. Maybe I already sure just wanted to catch it. Oh my god. This one a lot. Cowboy like me. Tennis court, Lord reference. Oh, I can't keep reading ahead. They got some fancy little, like, ellipses graphics here on Apple Music, y'all. Oh, ma'am. Not the cowboys like me. There's something earlier about Eyes Full of Stars. There was something earlier about Eyes Full of Stars. Oh, okay, sugar baby. I guess this is a long song. That's gossip. Oh my god, forever is the sweetest guy. <laughs> what if I never loved again? I don't think I'm emotionally prepared to watch myself watch, like listen to these. I'm like, damn, you really were going through it with that one. You look out the window. Long story short, okay, fatefully is the first word. Okay. She said, yeah, I got that garage band loop. Rabbit hole. Girl, I think we all know what this is about. Oh, that's sad. <gasps> Golden Gates. They held the key for me. This is why we can't have nice things. Lock me out, then threw the key. What? I know who this is about. I know this is what this is about. Evermore. Walking it. Walking it. <laughs> this one's about, like, fell on the rabbit hole. If y'all have a connection to the song Wonderland, that's all I'm saying. Fell off the premises, 2016, you know, that whole situation. Clung to the nearest lips. Tom Hiddleston, and then now Ronjo. Yep. This is a disclaimer that I did not read the liner notes Miss Taylor Allison Swift posted before listening to the album. Therefore, I did not know the meaning of this song upon listening for the first time. Please don't cancel me. Instead, laugh at my terrible analysis. Much love. Okay, I'm saying this before I even start it. I feel like the beginning of Marjorie sounds like August. It sounds like the... So, and Marjorie, I wonder if that's August girl's name. It's because of me. Not this. Oh, this is. I she tweeted about this and that one thing. I feel like I remember this part in that. I should read back. That. Hmm. Who's Marjorie? <laughs> and Marjorie. Ann. 
much power you forget to be polite. Never do it. Okay. Marjorie. Marjorie. Oh my god. I heard the name Marjorie earlier today. I'm a psychic. I haven't seen my horse cup in a while, you guys. Autumn chill. Amber skies. So they are. I said again August vibes, I don't know why. Maybe it was just me. What were they tweeting all that about August about, y'all? Huh? 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 I'm still waiting on my August music video, my Betty music video, the trio. Can you grab whatever we got next? Closure. It's been a long time. It's been a long time in our little mime. You can have that one, Taylor. It wasn't right. But it wasn't okay. Yes, I got to let her. Oh. Yes, I'm doing better. It could be to know ya. What's the letter in the better? Don't treat me like some situation that needs to be handled. Okay, Olivia Pope. My tears and my beers. I don't drink. Not relatable, really. Yes, Y'all, I can't. What's this? What's this song about getting the sending a letter or something? What song is that? Hello, I'm like 90% positive what I'm thinking of, and this is In California by Lana Del Rey. I shouldn't have done it, but I read it in your letter. You said to a friend that you wish you were doing better. I think that is what I keep thinking of, but if there's a reference that I'm missing, let me know down below. Yo, I need to eat a Tom's. I need to take a Tom's. Everyone misses his last song, Green November. This is very, sounds like Exile right now. Sorry, y'all. Who's this last song? We have two bonus tracks, but I'm not sure I can get those. I still haven't gotten my stuff, no, I'm kidding. I wish I had my card again. Oh, I had to return it and get a new one. I don't know where that's at. Oh, I know where it's at. It just came while editing this. Here's that. Hello, I'm, you all my hair, a different kind of whack. I'm breaking in right now. Well, guess what came in the mail? My cardigan. At least that's what I'm assuming is. Actually, my two cardigans. I have, no, no, nobody. I've been editing part of the video for nobody, no crime. Y'all, this video is taking a lot longer to edit too, so. No shade. But I thought I'd do a unpackaging. So we have the bag. I'd reorder it because I got a size, I don't know, the sizing on the website was weird. I don't know if y'all had the same issue, but I'm closing my eyes and I'm gonna show y'all first. Did like confetti fall out? Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god, all this confetti. The way that they packaged the confetti was like, just like up in here. <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> it's one of the Christmas cards. <gasps> no way. Oh my god, this is like the drama of it all. The Is it like the third album? Who knows? That's gaggy. And I have the cardigan that people think is gonna be the third album. The amount of confetti I got, the way that they just put it all in like one ball. Oh my god. Y'all, oh my god, I didn't show y'all. Oh my god, this is so cute. I think, oh my god, the green. What if this doesn't fit me? But the last one was so big on me, this one has to fit me. <gasps> oh my god. You're kidding. This one's still, similar to the way that these fit, like, they're supposed to be, like, large, I know, but... Oh my god, I love this. This is so cute. Okay, so we have the gray one. Obsessed. Y'all, I thought this stream was about to come undone. It's not invisible, because I can clearly see it, so... It's not an Easter egg. And this one, I love that it says... Taylor Swift on the bottom instead of the folklore patch. The ones that they have on the website now, that they just relaunched for the Evermore, like, new merch, have... They say the Taylor Swift in the bottom and not folklore album. Okay, now we got the normal cardigan. I've already done an unboxing of one of these, so yes, this is a folklore or folklore album. Oh yeah, yeah, these smell. Wait, mine is. A, oh no, it's just a random yarn. That's so weird. The okay, what is this? Is this a girl? The random pieces of yarn from the factory. These ones smell. They smell so suspicious, but this one doesn't. Yeah, this one. This one smells a little bit like it. It's just like very kind of like I don't know. Yeah, let's see this one on. Oh my god! Ah! Wait. <gasps> Taylor! Girl! Please, Taylor! This can't be meant to be here. Y'all. Let's have this on video I can send to the people be like, y'all got me messed up. Can't imagine this is supposed to be here. Oh my god, that's what, like, look, I'm almost positive. Oh no, wait, never mind. I thought this was for that. Girl. But y'all, honestly, maybe I'm the low key. This means I can get one once it doesn't say this 
on it, I can go into this on the bottom. The way that we have to get three whole cardigans from Taylor Swift's people, so it'll be my third cardigan. Oh my god. I don't like the bitty bitty bad bad. I mean, if it didn't have this hole in it, I'm so upset that this girl, I just want, I just want my cardigan. <laughs> not gonna email them. Girl, who knows how long it's gonna be? It's gonna be like five weeks now before I get it. Let's be real. Come on now. Well, at least I have my green one I can wear. Okay, well, how come every time I be doing one of these unboxings on of <laughs> these cardigans, it never turns out well? They got me messed up. Oh my god, she's been on since July. Girl, if you listen to an album, then what do you mean? Oh. Hey, December. Girl, I'm going back to it. Lord. Yeah, yeah. What I used to fight for. Oh my god. Okay, this is definitely an exile. Bear girl, welcome to the party. Show up at the end. About to shut up at your party. Florence in the machine. Come on, now, girl. This song definitely is like giving me very much the Exile sequel. Am I getting a lot of allusions to other songs? I think this is the last song. Well, girls, I feel like I'm at a movie. Oh my god, I feel like, like y'all know the feeling when you like walk out with me like I'm a new person. Wow, well, like new outlook on life in the next couple of days. That's how I literally just felt getting done with that album. Oh my god, y'all. Ah! Ah! Ow. Ooh. Oh, I just like caught my chat. I wonder if y'all could hear that. That was crazy, y'all. What do we think? I'm love. I love. I love. Okay, girl, I'm gonna read her little thing she wrote. Let's discuss the songs. Before I knew it, there were 17 tales. Oh my god. Okay, so these are all tales, but some of these I know are about her, girl. No shade, Taylor. I mean, no. But she's a, her own tale, period. Okay, intersection with the point. Taylor, the one about two young con artists who fall in love while hanging out at fancy resorts trying to score rich romantic beneficiaries. Okay, that was Cowboy Like Me. Was that Cowboy Like Me? I think so. Long time college sweethearts had very different plans for the same night. One that ended it and one who brought a ring. That's Champagne Problems. And I think that I think that's also the other one. Yeah, I think Happiness and Champagne Problems, they be twinsies a little bit. And then, so we have Dorothea, the girl who left her small town to chase down Hollywood dreams. And what happens when she comes back for the holidays and rediscovers an old flame? So that is Tis the Damn Season. Sorry, watch my profanity. I'm so sorry. Tis the Damn Season and Dorothea are then those two. And I think they're... The Unhappily Ever After Anthology, A Marriage Has Gone Bad, that includes infidelity, ambivalent toleration, and even murder. The most righteous moment to eventually fall on the realization that maybe the only path to healing is to wish happiness on the one took away from you. Once I, my grandmother, Marjorie, who still visits me sometimes, if only in my dreams. If only in my dreams I'll be home. So the Unhappily Ever After one, I think we have Tolerate It is for sure, and the Unhappily Ever After. Happiness is the one about, I think something happiness, obviously. Ivy, unhappily ever after. Not long story short. That one's about her. I just can tell it. Marjorie, not me being like, and then it's not. It's about her grandma. Hmm. Closure. I need your closure. I don't know what that's about. What you think about? Going off right now, there was one I didn't like the most. There were a couple I was like, eh, about. Little girl me, I'm sure. Right off the top of my head, we got Willow. She went off on that one. Champagne problems, I like. Gold Rush, yes. I need to listen to that one again, but I liked it the first time. To same season, that one I she did go off on. I'm excited to come back to that one. Tolerate it. That one's gonna be a slow burn on me, I think. A slow burn, it's gonna be like, it's, a, it's gonna be like one day it's gonna be like, oh, so we're here right now. No I no crime. That one went off, yeah, I liked it. I, need, I liked it, I liked it. I liked the beat. Happiness, I think so. It was one that I was like, ah. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll come back to it. Dorothea, so we had to stay on her. Coney Island, very interesting. A lot of thoughts on that one. Ivy, yeah, I like that one a lot. Cowboy Like Me, yeah, that's gonna be a slow burn too. That's gonna be a one that just all of a sudden goes <clears throat> And I'm like, ah. Long story short, she was cute, she was fun. Marjorie, I need to get the one another listen now that I know it's about her grandma. Closure, yeah. Very interesting. Evermore. Yeah, very interesting, very interesting. I would say, I'm supposed to say my favorite was like Ivy, but I'm gonna cut up here in like one second. Like, ready? Hello. 
Welcome back everybody. So it's a couple days later and I'm just now finishing up the video, popping back in to give my kind of final thoughts about the album. I've had a lot more time to listen to it now and I want to give my final ranking. Now, I know I did not go into very much like description about like the theories, blah, 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 because this was a reaction video. So I'm just be reacting to this stuff. And as I said at the beginning of this, like my reactions don't necessarily hold up over time. As we saw in the videos, some of them didn't hold up, you know, 10 minutes into the future. So don't be like out here commenting like, this is not what this song is about. Okay, I know, okay, we get it, we get it, we get it. We're learning, we learn, you know, you listen to something more than once. So she went all the stories that are connected. Like I have two rankings of the songs now. I did a ranking of just me looking at those songs, listing them down of my favorites, right? And then I did a ranking with the Sorter. If you're a fan of a musician, you've probably done one of these sorters before. I did one of those and I want to do the two to see like what I thought it was and then like mathematically, statistically what it would be. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna go with, I guess the list I made first. My hair, y'all, I'm sorry. Number one, we have Ivy, followed by Champagne Problems, followed by Gold Rush, followed by Nobody No Crime, followed by Tolerate It, followed by Willow, followed by Dorothea, followed by Tis the Damn Season, followed by Long Story Short, followed by Cowboy Like Me, followed by Evermore, followed by Marjorie, followed Followed by Coney Island, followed by Happiness, followed by Closure. Me putting some of these songs near the bottom, it's no shade to the songs. They're all good songs. This is just what I'm vibing with. So if y'all are vibing with other songs, then you can vibe with your other songs. Like we all can vibe to our own songs, you know? Now looking at the statistical results from doing this sorter, it's pretty similar actually when I, so number one, we have IV. And then number two, Tied, we have Champagne Problems and Gold Rush, which I would agree. And then four, we have Tolerate It, followed by Nobody No Crime at five, which I kind of agree with. Six, we have Willow. Seven, we have Tis a Damn Season and Dorothea tied there. Nine, we have Long Story Short. 10, we have Cowboy Like Me. 11, we have Marjorie. 12, we have Evermore. 13, we have Happiness, Coney Island, and Closure tied. So for like the last three. Very interesting, very interesting. Okay, we're going back to me originally reacting to this. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys, you just saw me editing. That's so crazy, I think, allegedly. What did, what did Grant have to say? What were his favorites? Oh my god, like, what was he thinking? What was up with that? Let me know what you think down below. Comment of the day, what are y'all's favorite songs on the album? Okay, what do you think about my favorite songs? What do you think the connections are? There's so much to comment about, y'all. Just say Swifties for life down below. I don't know, y'all. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Also, do you guys want me to do my video? Now that, like, <laughs> she kind of said y'all ain't getting a video about Betty. No, I'm joking, but if y'all want to see that video about Betty, let me know. I was about to start working on it the other day and I never got around to it. So if you guys want to see that, I have a lot of evidence collected over time about the true story behind Betty and August and Cardigan that I don't think a lot of people are ready for. Um, I'm still not a bad boy piece of information. I have insider tea. Dubai. Anyways, <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. Stream folklore. And evermore. Oh my god. Wait, I just the way I just my mind was like stream folklore. Yo, we gotta get on stream evermore and folklore. Stream evermore. I gotta start program stream evermore. Stream evermore. Stream evermore. Stream evermore. Stream. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. All that down below. Hit the notification bell. Follow my social media, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, also down below. Y'all singing in Cruel Summer in there? Mm, that's top five songs all the time? Yeah, okay. You know, they agreed. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully, soon. Hopefully, you're seeing this video. Haha. <laughs> Bye. 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 Bye.